I have a Samsung Galaxy A52 here. I'm going to show you how to transfer videos and um, photos directly to a Windows computer, PC, or laptop using the charging cable. So first thing is go ahead and grab your uh, charging cable and you want to plug the USB-A into the USB port into your Windows computer. And the other side here, we're going to go ahead USB-C. We're going to go ahead and plug this directly into the phone right here. And then let me go ahead and log in here. Now we should get a message here. Oops, let me try to log in here. Okay, you should get a message that says allow uh, phone to access. If you get that message, go ahead and click on allow or OK. Okay, so mine didn't come up, but let's see if it shows it. So let me go to my file explorer, that little folder right there. Let me just click on that and let me see if I can see uh, A72 here. Let's see. Okay, so I see my Galaxy. Um, a A52, sorry. So I see that right there. So I can go ahead and click on that. And then my phone, let me double click on that. Now all your photos and videos that you take, it goes directly into the DCIM folder, okay? DCIM. Go ahead and double click on that. And it has some folders here. Let me go into my camera photo here where all my photos and videos are. Oops, let me double click on that. And you can see I have some photos and videos here. Now from here, you can go ahead and put it anywhere on a computer. You can even just drag and drop it onto your desktop. You can see that right there. Now what I typically do is I'll just go ahead and uh, create a new folder. Let me just delete these. I'll go up to the desktop here. I'll right click and I'll go down to new and I'll go to folder. And then I'll just name this, uh, we'll just name it A52 folder. And now I can go ahead and drag and drop um, whichever photo or video I want directly into there. Okay, so for example, I just highlight all of them and I'll drag and drop it into my new folder I call A52. Give it one second to transfer here. There we go, we're done. And now if I double click on my A52 folder, this is all saved to my computer now and I can go ahead and uh, unplug my phone and there we go, there's all my photos and videos. And now from here I can go ahead and edit these photos and videos. So pretty simple. Any uh, questions or issues, just comment below. All right. Good luck, guys.